Hey, what's good, YouTube? Mike here, and this is Pro Guitarist Reacts. I'm about to check out this new video by Chris Webby and Ren. The song's called Baggage. Of course, I know who Ren is. I've reacted to tons of his songs. You can check them out. Uh, I've got playlists. Uh, I don't even know how many. There's so many. Uh, and I've loved every one of them, so check that out. But uh, I'm coming into this cold as far as Chris Webby goes. So I'm about to find out what Chris Webby's all about. I'm sure there's lots of Ren fans who are in the same boat as me. And uh, for you Chris Webby fans, well, welcome to the channel. Click like and subscribe. Um, yeah, let's get into this and uh, see what it's all about. Completely cold. Nothing to ruin any surprises that may lay in store. So let's get to it. Okay, we got guitar. Okay, I'm catching like uh, somewhere between um, Dream On and uh, While well, My Guitar Gently Weeps. Those, that's kind of the vibe of this uh, little guitar thing going on here. Actually, let's just go roll it back. That's really setting the mood. Let's let's do this again. Falling by the wayside with these habits I keep shaking. No jeans with the same old baggy in my pocket. Trying to find a way. I missed, missed some of the, the lyrics there. I was uh, into the vibe and noticing that uh, Ren is singing the hook. Let's see. Falling by the wayside with these habits I keep shaking. No jeans with the same old baggy in my pocket. Trying to find a way, but ain't no way back where I've gone. Knew me with the same old baggage in my closet. Yeah, yeah. Can't say me, y'all. They say I'm. Whoa, that guy had no hair or scalp or skin or anything in the back of his head, did he? That's crazy. Can't say me, y'all. They say I'm lost. I can't even start to count all of the days I... What was that, Ren even singing the intro? This guy's voice sounds a little bit, a little, a little bit like Ren. I think I started stuttering there. I'm so surprised. Was that Webby singing the intro? Or maybe was it both of them? Because there was definitely a uh, voice, an octave higher doing like a head voice thing. Okay, now now I, I, I thought I knew what was happening in that intro, but now I'm not sure at all. Me with the same old baggage in my closet. Yeah, yeah. So strange. Can't say me, y'all. They say I'm lost. I can't even start to count all of the days I've lost. At the nights of losing count of all the drinks I bought. Self medicating just to get the weight I lost. Only starts with a shot, then it's four in a row. Next thing you in the bathroom, scoring some blow. See, it is what it is, and it's all that I Okay. I think I know where he's going with this. Um. Yeah, I don't think I've ever talked about this on uh, on my channel here, or publicly very much for that matter, but uh, there was definitely a time where uh, this was a uh, problem I was facing, and, uh, and I was trying to get, oh, it was like a carousel that just kept going faster and faster, and then you just couldn't get off. 
Um, and like he says in the lyrics, it starts with a drink or two, a shot or two, uh, you know, and it ends up, uh, ends up calling some, some guy on your speed dial that, uh, shows up late, at, you know, for those of you who know, you know. Four in a row, next thing you in the bathroom, scoring some blow. See, it is what it is, and it's all that I know. But I'm getting to a fork in a row. I know the way it's been, I take it in. Feel I gotta start learning to pray again. I try to wash away the sins, but they like tattoos on my skin. I've been sitting here scrubbing them, trying to cover them, but I'm stuck with them. Okay, that's heavy. I mean, heavy imagery. Look at that. Wow. You got the uh, swastika tattoo. I, I this is. I think this is one I'm gonna have to watch a couple times because this. Uh, there's a, there's a lot to unpack on this. Skin. I've been sitting here scrubbing them, trying to cover them, but I'm stuck with them, struggling, drunk and stumbling while I'm juggling habits that are both the cause and the cure of my suffering. I know it's becoming a little troubling. The hell, falling by the wayside with these habits, I keep shaking. Okay, these are all zombies or 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 dead people walking. So what, so this, the one guy had a, like a, looked like a bullet hole. Okay, let's see this again. No, before. Okay, so the guy in the hospital gown had what? I've been sitting here scrubbing them, trying to cut. Well, the one guy just had the swastika. He didn't seem to be. Mortally wounded. But I'm stuck with them, struggling, drunk and stumbling while I'm juggling. Habits that are both the cause and the cure of my suffering. I know it's becoming a little troubling. Falling by the wayside. Sorry if I'm stopping so much, but there, like I, there is so much to unpack, and this is intense. So obviously, we got the the the, the black dude playing pool and being like his buddy buddy with dude with the swastika this is some this is some different reality of some sort becoming a little troubling falling by the wayside with these habits i keep shaking new jeans with the same old baggy in my pocket yeah did you see that phone? Okay, so this is a, uh, it's, uh, also strange because, uh, when I was facing these issues, that would have been a flip phone would have been what I would have been dialing up on. I'm with these habits, I keep shaking new jeans with the same old baggy in my pocket. Yeah. Trying to find a way, but they ain't no way back where I've gone. Knew me with the same old baggage in my closet. Yeah, yeah. Okay, here's Rand. Bloody red mud, they whisper and murmur. How did Ren get here? Nature or nurture? I nurture my nature. Divine misbehavior, reaching for a bottle. Okay, that's a bar. I nurture my nature. <laughs> there you go. We're gonna roll it back. Mud, they whisper and murmur. How did Ren get here? Nature or nurture? I nurture my nature. Divine misbehavior. Reaching for a bottle. Thought the spirit was my savior. Chopping on my brain cells when I'm reaching for the part. But part's the only shot I got to stop this ticking clock. Tick tick counting down the minutes till that something in me pops. And resurrects a disconnect that helps me self destruct. And when I'm down on my luck, wasted, brain dead, vacant. Faded. I get wasted. You get brain dead. Mind so vacant. I'm so faded. All the time. Wasted. Another line. Brain dead. Feeling so vacant. Leaving on faded. Complicated in-house patient. Wasted. Brain dead. Vacant. Faded. 
Damn. Production is off the charts. We've got Ren bouncing from ear to ear. Um, yeah, I'm glad I got headphones on for this one because uh, I have to wear headphones for this current setup. Mike keeps slipping down on me. Let me see if I can tighten it up. All right, we're going to go back and listen to this again. So many bars, and the production was just so cool. All right. We'll roll it back a little more. Spirit was my savior. Chopping on my brain cells when I'm reaching for the part. But part's the only shot I got to start this ticking clock. Tick tick counting down the minutes till that something in me pops. And resurrects a disconnect that helps me self destruct. And when I'm down on my luck, wasted, brain dead, vacant. Right. So much truth in there. And uh, ironically, one of the things when you're in that situation, in that cycle of, a, of an addictive lifestyle, is that uh, one of the things you're trying to forget is all the time you've wasted with the addiction. So, you know, aside from what brought you there in the first place, the fact of, of all the time that you've wasted is also, also builds up on top. It's a really, it's, it's a very tough cycle to break out of when you're in it. And, um, you know, in my own case, I could say um, it hit me after I had uh, lived the, the, the rock star lifestyle. And uh, it was hard for real life to keep up. It was hard for real life to keep up with, the, with what rocks, you know, living a rock star. I'm not saying I was a rock star, but I was definitely in the circle. You know, partying like one and, and, and hanging out with uh, a lot of them. Okay. Let's just uh, roll this back a touch again. Because you can never listen to it too many times. Do that something in me pops. I'm resurrects a disconnect that helps me self-destruct. When I'm down on my luck. Wasted. Brain dead. Vacant. New jeans with the same old baggy in my pocket, yeah. Trying to find a way, but ain't no way back where I've gone. New me with the same old baggage in my closet. Okay. Damn. Wow. Okay, so. This is strange. This was much better done, but my band back in 90, I think it was 98, 97 or 98, we had a song called uh, Spaceman. This was, I was in a band called Artificial Joy Club. We were on uh, our, uh, Interscope Records, and uh, we made a uh, a video for a song called Spaceman, and it was uh, well, the, they you know we didn't have all this storyline with the you know the people in the missing parts of their skulls or nothing like that. That was dope AF. But uh, what we did is 
we, but we had the same thing where uh, our, our singer died in a, in a car crash in the video. And, uh, but the whole video was in reverse. Not important to this right now, but I'm in the middle of it. I, I might as well finish the story, right? Uh, so the whole video was in reverse, in reverse, started from the crash and rolled back through the night. Anyway, you can check it out. It's on YouTube. A song called Spaceman. I don't get nothing for it. I didn't own the publishing for that song. So just saying. Um, damn, I went on too long. Let's uh, recapture here the end of this video. Oh yeah, that's all, without the the heavy guitar. I want to. Yeah, I do want to go back a little more. I want to come talk about where the heavy guitar starts coming in. Same old baggy. Okay, it's a little before that. So it's right here. Sounds like a uh, buzz face, perhaps. Wonder if Ren's playing guitar on this. Um, definitely sounds up Ren's alley guitar wise. Fuzz face was uh was the what Jimi hendrix used to get his uh, distorted sounds so it would make sense that uh you know given the option of using one that ren would choose to new jeans with the same old bag in my pocket oh yeah i'm talking like it's obvious of course he has referenced jimmy Hendrix in uh, previous songs like High Ren, for instance. New jeans with the same old baggy in my pocket. Yeah. Trying to find a way, but ain't no way. Oh, what does his uh, jacket say? Because that's got to mean something. Nothing Ren does doesn't mean something. Yeah. Hollywood spat me out. Okay, what's the statement? I know he did go to Hollywood. He did a uh, a live video for Murderer, I think it was, in the Hollywood Hills. Overlooking the city. Trying to find a way, but ain't no way. Nice. Purgatory Pub. Ah, right. That was at the beginning. Purgatory Pub. Makes sense. It all makes a little bit more sense now. Well, so that's Chris Webby. Okay. So he's like that. He's, uh, you know, Sounds to me like he's a heavy thinker, has a concept, sees it through, sounds very compatible with Ren. Have they, have they worked together before? Is this their first time working together? I'm guessing the video was uh, made in the uh, United States because the billiard table had American American balls. I wasn't sure. <laughs> I was trying to run that through my brain for a second to make sure it didn't sound stupid. American balls. Okay. Yeah, the numbers on them. I think in uh, the UK, they have just colors on billiard balls. Well, what did you guys think? I'd really love to know. Uh, let me know what I missed because I'm sure there was a bunch of stuff like, uh, you know, little Easter eggs and whatnot that I, I probably, that I probably didn't catch. Um, 
but let me know down in the comments yeah i look forward to seeing you guys there and uh until next time peace out we'll see you soon